All right, guys, one of the most common questions I get using the Crystal Sky is uh, I hear a lot of people having trouble playing their uh, files on the Crystal Sky that were taken off of their craft. In this example, I'm going to be using the Mavic Air and playing the videos are recorded onto the Crystal Sky. So uh, basically, if you go into your applications and you hit gallery, right now all you're going to get is basically what was recorded to the Crystal Sky. Here I have about 75 files and this is all recorded to the internal of the Crystal Sky where if I need the audio, it's there and ready for me. But uh, the major question I get is how do you see the video taken on your craft on the Crystal Sky? A lot of people seem to can't figure out how to get it to play and stuff. So I thought I'd do a quick video on how to do that. So uh, basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the uh, vid uh, SD card out of my Mavic Air here. I shot some videos just a little while ago and everything to have on here ready. These things are a little bit annoying to get out. Got my Crystal Sky right here. I've already got one SD card in here now that's for recording my internal stuff. So I'm gonna put this in slot two. Give it a second to load everything. And there is kind of two options here on how to see these. The easiest way is the applications, go back to gallery. All of a sudden I have a nice little folder right there that says 100 media, which is off of the Mavic Air here. So I'm gonna click on it. It will load my videos that I've done, it'll load the pictures. Here's the first test video i done. Starts playing, I can fast forward through it. back up okay go back out there's a picture I took you can actually swipe across it too however you feel another easy, uh, way to uh, get into it is go back to your thing if you hit explore okay basically when you get here you'll be to this main screen internal memory SD card 1 SD card 2 I know it's SD card two, so I go to DCI int folder, then media, and there they are again. You can simply click on one, it'll start playing. You actually get a little different setup right here if you had volume. You can delete it, audio track, back, you can look at a picture. That's the quick and easy way to see your files if you shot them directly off of your Inspire, just, just whatever, you know. Stick it in your memory card, pop it out, you're ready to go. You can see your footage in real time right there. Or if you have it set up like I do where it records the screen, I can go just right here and look at the, all the videos that are recorded. Not as good a quality, of course, but they're all here. If you have any questions about anything I've done in this video, please leave it in the comments and I'll answer them as fast as I can. As always, guys, thanks for watching.